video. Yes, I'm wearing the same clothes that I was wearing in the video that I just dropped on a total different subject. So that means that I'm going to have to change my opening drive because I'm not just a fashionista. Um, I'm speaking on different topics, different conversations. Um, and I know you guys are here for it and I appreciate you being here, but this is going to be a conversation about my handbags. Okay. So you've already seen this beautiful creature, this beautiful bag. You guys, she is absolutely gorgeous. Isn't she? I, I, I love her to pieces. I really do. I love her. Um, she's gorgeous, roomy, all of that. Um, let me turn off my ceiling fan, you guys, because it is warm outside, but it's cold in my house. So give me one moment. I'm going to step away for a second. I know. I know. I've been making videos all day, ladies and gentlemen. And when I first started making this video, I'm um, making videos, it was a little warm. But it has since cooled off um, in the home. So I don't want to be freezing and mouth chattering and all that while I am talking to you guys. So that's that. Okay? That's that. All right. So I am back. And I'm going to do a comparison. Um, And I am so... <laughs> happy about two purchases, one from the Gently Used site and one directly from Louis Vuitton. Okay. So, the excursion. Y'all see it, right? Y'all see it. Y'all see it. Okay. The excursion. This is initially a backpack. I did a full video on her. I did. Um, and I see the cons in this bag more than the pros. It's a high possibility that she won't be a part of my collection <laughs> for long. Um, it's a high possibility that she will be going back to the store, to the Louis Vuitton store. Um, and let me tell you why. Okay, so let me just speak on my decisions, on why I'm looking at this bag differently. Um, at first, she was the apple to my eye. I was like, oh my God, this bag is everything on ice, right? She's perfect. Um, I love the strap, the Vachetta strap. I love the, um, the flexibility on, um, making it an actual backpack. Um, and then the, um, availability of actually making it a crossbody. And this is not the strap that came with it. This is from my Neo Noe. Um, the actual straps that came with this beautiful backpack she's stuffed with bubble wrap our inside right is the Vache it's the monogram straps and they're on the inside here and they're adjustable and all that and I'm not going out on the limb or anything like that but I can tell you truthfully and honestly if I was to keep this bag if I was to keep this bag I would never carry it as a backpack a backpack, and this is to Louis Vuitton as well. It's supposed to be carefree. A backpack is not supposed to be one that you would have to baby, right? You should be able to just carry that backpack, not worry about inclement weather or anything like that. Y'all know me. Y'all know that I absolutely love what? Monogram and Vachetta leather. That is one reason why when my spouse bought this for Valentine's Day, I was ecstatic. I was like, oh my God. And then I look and I saw how much this bag cost. And I was like, oh my God. 
Um, babe, this is a little steep. And I don't know if I want to keep this in my collection. And he was like, it's my gift. I was like, okay, I don't want to sound ungrateful. Thank you. And, and, and I love it. I do. I do love it. But this, I don't like a bag that I have to baby unless it is, unless I'm babying it for my own personal reasons, not because it needs to be baby, like my graceful, like my, my Noah GM. Um, what other bag do I baby? I don't baby my Diane cause it's already treated. The speedy is treated. Um, The Montaigne I don't treat. I don't baby. Um, I think this is really, um, besides my um, Graceful and the Neo, um, the Noe GM, this is the only one that I really um, have had to try to baby since I've had her for a little over a week. Um, and because she's only a week old, I think she's going back to the luxury house and I'm going to tell my spouse why. Um, she's beautiful. It's nothing wrong with this, right? But I truly believe that Louis Vuitton made a mistake with this, um, with this bag because there's a backpack out there that's everything. That is everything. And, um, <laughs> And she is currently, I believe she's discontinued, period. Um, but I don't think of a bag that's structured like this as a backpack. This is a handbag to me that can be a backpack. You see the difference? This is a bag that is a handbag that can be transferred into a backpack. It is being sold as a backpack, but I don't think it should be sold as a backpack. This is also not unisex to me. To me, my opinion, this is feminine. The bag looks feminine. Everything about this bag, I can't see my husband carrying this. Maybe a young college um, boy in college maybe carry, maybe carry this as a backpack, but I really don't see it. I, I feel like she. this looks feminine. And a lot of Louis Vuitton's backpacks are unisex. This one does not look unisex to me. She's beautiful. Don't get me wrong, because I love Bichetta Leather and Monogram. So that's not the problem. The problem is that um, it's a lot of Bichetta Leather on this backpack. And backpacks are supposed to be carefree. So I love her, but the kinds are endless. Um, the Vachetta, um, I feel that it is not unisex. It's a beautiful bag, beautiful handbag. I love it, but I would only carry this as a crossbody if I was to keep it. So let me present to you, um, present to some and introduce to others. One of the bags that I slept on. She been out for a while, y'all. I slept on her. I didn't, I knew she existed. I saw her. Um, I realized she was out there. Um, I gave a little side eye every now and then. And for some reason, just like the graceful, I never purchased her. I never went out there. And I had the same reaction with this bag that I had with the graceful. And y'all already know how I feel about the graceful. Let's talk about the Palm Springs PM. Not the mini, not the MM, but the PM is everything, 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 everything about this backpack makes sense. I am, oh God, I'm in love with this bag. This bag screams luxury. It screams perfection, guys. It, it screams like, why Louis Vuitton? Why would you ever take her off? Now, when she was on the site, because I used to hear people talk about it all the time, 
people were trying to order the reverse monogram um, PM of the Palm Springs, and it would always be sold out. You could call your CA if you had one, or you could take a chance and go into the luxury house and see if they actually had one, which I doubt very seriously at the luxury house they would have one. But she sold out. She, You couldn't keep her in. Um, and this is the second version of it. So, I'm all over the place, so let me just go there. I got her off of the generally used site at a slam dunk price. Y'all, I be making deals. And the reason how I, the reason, the way I got a deal off of this is because I have returned another bag that I never did present to you guys. Um, and it was a, it was kind of like an impulse buy that I never should have purchased it was a YSL bag. Um, it was nothing wrong with the YSL. I love YSL. Um, but the previous owner of that bag, mm -mm. I turned it back in. I had a pretty decent credit on here on the um, Dinley U site. And I used it to um, get the Palm Springs Mini. I had to pay... Um, I think maybe $300 more after um, using the credit. Maybe three or $400 more um, towards it. But she's mine now. As you see, the tag is off. She belongs to me, and she should have been in my collection a long time ago. So let's get into it. This is the second generation, the second version of this um, um, backpack. The first... Um, version of this backpack came out with the treacherous lip. Louis Vuitton, please stop putting lips on certain things. <laughs> That's the reason why I got the um, bum bag. Um, and the bum bag, I know a cobbler here in Tennessee, and they reconstructed my bum bag. I already did a video on it. If you go through my archives, you'll see it. And they, um, they took off the lip and they pretty much did it like how this is and how the new bum bags are now um, that Louis Vuitton actually came out with, right? So the, the lip from the original Palm Springs was causing zipper issues. So they remade it and took off the lip and the zipper is butter. I did, they have the old version on the Gently Use site. You thought I was going to get it? It was, a, it was, the, it was very, it was less. I could have got that and probably got some uh, SLG and, and, um, with, with that bag. But I wasn't going to get that old version with the lip on top of it and then have to take it to a cobbler to get the lip off. That would have been crazy. Spend less, but then turn around, have to spend more money to get the lip taken off. So, no, that would have been dumb. So, I got the new one. And when I tell you, I don't know who had this prior to me, but thank you. They took well care of... I don't know why I'm holding it to the side. They took well care of this beautiful, beautiful piece of work. Um, I love me a good backpack. I love me a good backpack, y'all. Um... And what I found out after looking at certain videos that she can take a punch. When I tell y'all she can take a whole lot, this backpack can fill up a whole lot in here. I don't have her anywhere near capacity that she can um, hold. Um, so I know that the MM is huge. If the PM can take everything and then some, I know that the MM is huge. But let's just look at her. This comes in um, the mini, the PM, and the MM, right? This is the PM. The, this comes in the reverse monogram and the monogram. This is a carefree, all-weather backpack like all backpacks should be. See the difference? And don't be, don't be, um, don't let the size fool you. Even though this 
kind of comes up to this inside and it kind of looks like they're almost the same size. This is tremendously smaller than this. This carries a lot, but it does not carry anywhere near as much as this bag. She is not even filled and I got all of my essentials in here. She is not, she's not filled to capacity. I can't put all of my essentials in here. So, everything about this bag is butter. These little tabs is leather, leather. The handle, oh, let's just talk about it, y'all. The handle, oh my God. It is so soft and just butter. I don't know who had an issue with this because I took her out today to um, the opening of a new store in our area. Oh my God. Y'all don't know. The people that got an issue with this, I don't know why y'all got an issue. This is leather and it is so soft and comfortable. Why do y'all have a problem with this? Maybe because the Palm Springs Mini is made different and it's, 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 the, um, it's a strap instead of this type of strap. This is luxury. This is luxury. And I'm kind of glad that it was that is not removable because um, we would be trying to carry this as a handbag. And it probably would have been cute as a handbag, but I don't know. I don't know. Um, I really don't. I really don't. Um, everything about her is butter, you guys. Everything. So let's open her up. She is not even full to capacity. I don't have it organized. I have an organizer on the way. If you know me, you know I don't spend a lot of money on my organizers. Um, I don't spend... I get my organizers from Amazon, right? And they, I mean, whatever people may feel like is expensive, they can be anywhere from $25 to $30. I know people to pay almost $100 for the organizer. Why? <laughs> I mean, it's just an organizer. Um, this pocket is butter. I have my Tylenol in here and my hand sanitizer. But if I wanted to put like my ear pods or something like that, they will fit. They will fit. Y'all, I'm in love with this bag. Everything about this bag is perfection. Everything about it. It I don't have any cons for this backpack. The backpack is backpacking. <laughs> it is doing what a backpack PM should be doing. It is adjustable. It's got the seven holes here where you can adjust it for your comfort. Everything about this. Everything. A great traveling backpack. I'll take my double bag, put this on my back. And, and and then you can put it on your shoulder. You Oh, yes. Now, are these two great bags? Yes. Are they two, are they two beautiful bags? Yes. One is a backpack. One is a handbag that can be a backpack. This is a backpack. <laughs> this is what a backpack should be. This is a handbag that can transfer into a backpack. You get me? You hear me, Louis? Um, hey, I'm just being real. I love Louis Vuitton. So when I speak on something, I'm giving my, my honest truth about it. This is perfection. I don't think this ever should have been discontinued. I think this should have remained on the um, website. Um, I just don't get it. This is one of the best hand, handbag backpacks that you could have ever created. A lot of people don't like this. I wouldn't hang a scarf from this. Um, I probably won't hang anything from it unless I can find like one of those little hand sanitizer um, things that can go through this and not squeeze the leather together. I don't want to squeeze that. But if if anything, it'll just sit there. People don't like that. I mean, I don't understand some of the cons y'all have over this. This, this is the way a backpack should be. It is a backpack that we're carrying as a handbag. Um, so it's backpacking. Um, and I'm, it really is. I got my charm. These charms, um, came from Amazon. Um, I think they cost a little, um, like maybe like $10 less than that. Maybe, 
Um, but yeah, little charming little things that I just hang from my bag. I don't, I get some little charms off of the generally used sites or eBay that's made from Louis Vuitton, but I would never buy a Twilly or an accessory such as this from Louis Vuitton. This is just absorbent. It's an absorbent amount of money. And I just, I feel like there's so many different options out there and no, I'm not going to do it. But yes, you guys. I'm in love with the Palm Springs PM. I will look at the mini, but I don't think the mini will do for me with this. Because if, if, if the mini is as small as it appears to be, and I can't put half of my essentials in there, and I'm getting it because it's cute, I don't, don't buy things because it's cute. If you got money to waste like that, buy it because it's cute. Um, but buy things because it's an investment and you're going to actually use it for what you're purchasing it for. Not because everybody has one and not because it's cute. This thing, I took it out today. I just took it out of the paper, out of the bag yesterday. I got it off the generally used site. It came right away. I couldn't wait. I filled up everything. I took everything out of here. No, I didn't have anything in her. I took everything out of here, loaded her up, added extra, and life is, is bliss. When I say I love this bag and everything about it, I love this bag and everything about it. She is perfection. So if you can ever, if you can find one of these, whether it's in the reverse monogram or in just the monogram, get your it is one of the best investments you can ever make i know people ha had issues with the corners and stuff like that fading i don't think that's going to be the case for me because this bag is pretty old this bag is it's 2024 20, this bag is 2018 i believe 2019 um it's five years old and she looks fantastic she looks fantastic. I, nothing is rubbing. You, This don't even look old. <laughs> it looks brand new. Um, so, great job to the previous owner. It's mine now. You're not getting it back. She belongs to me. She's in my collection. And she's going to be used. Trust and believe. Yes. So, thank you guys for listening. Um, next time I will do a video. I don't do what what's in the bag, what fits in the bag videos, because I feel like they're just long and drawn out. Um, I will, sh I, like I showed you what fit in there. Um, all my essentials fit, and, and I got room and space for a lot more. The phone that I'm recording on fits in there with no problem. I don't have to turn it around, how to squeeze it in, none of that. It fits right in, you guys. So that is a wonderful investment. Um, this one is great. I appreciate it. I love my husband for it. Um, I'm still on the fence. I got a few more days before I tell him I'm going to take it back. Um, so still debating on this. It may end up just staying in my collection, but Hey, right now she is a new handbag for me and I love her. Um, she's beautiful. Um, and she has a very beautiful look to her. And I appreciate everything that she brings. So, hey, I'm happy. I'm happy. 2024 is starting out great. Uh, my collection is growing even more. And my husband is going to kill me because I'm running out of space, you guys. I really am. Um, my, my bag room is filled so much that some of them, even my limited editions, have made their way to my closet. And I didn't think that I would have to do an overflow to my closet. Um, so right now I have two closets and a room filled with luxury handbags. So I'm going to do some selling on some bags that I haven't reached for. And then I'm just going to do a lot of organizing. I may buy a different organizer um, for how I want to set up my handbags to get them more organized. 
Um, cause right now I'm losing space for real losing space. Um, so I'm really thinking about how I'm going to do that. Um, because again, it, I, this is not a bragging thing. I'm just a collector of beautiful handbags. And after a while, um, my husband was like, you just basically threw me out the closet because I have nowhere to put my things. Your bags have taken over. And they have. <laughs> they have. They've taken over, you guys. They really have. But this is Try Love. Thank you so much for listening to me. Y'all know I'll just keep talking and talking and talking. Look forward to a new video that will be coming and dropping out later on today over two other tote bags that I didn't want to add to this video. I just wanted it to be a separate video altogether. Thank you for listening to me and have a peaceful day. Bye-bye.